Magic TV. My name's Craig. It is uh, six o'clock and it's time for a Magic Live. Now today I'm going to be doing a routine called Stick Pack. This has been created by me. Um, this has been something I've been doing for about 10 or 15 years. It's going to be appearing on a future project, which I'll tell you guys about in the future um, uh, when it comes out. It's a kind of a big project. But for now, I thought you'd like a sneak peek. So here it is, one of my favourite routines to perform. It's Stick Pack. Hey, Mace. How you doing? I'm good, man. Good. Another trick. Why not? Not to say, drew a stick, man. Uh, yeah. This is one arm longer than the other. Yeah, I know. Uh, this... <laughs> <laughs> he's kind of, he's, he's, he's challenged slightly, but it's okay. Uh, he's a special stick, man, though. He's a magic stick, man. Okay. No, he really is. You want to see why? I wouldn't expect anything there. I'll show you. 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 So, um, I've got a pack of 52 cards, yeah? Yeah. And we're going to take out the uh, the four aces. We're going to take out the uh, the ace of diamonds, the ace of hearts, the ace of spades, and then finally, somewhere in here, we have the ace of clubs, four aces. Mm -hmm. We're going to get back to those aces in a second, but first of all, I need you to pick a card, and it's fine if I'm allowed to see it. I can see it. It's not that sort of trick, so just say stop. Stop. There. Um, the joker. Okay, that's interesting. Do me a favour. Put your hand on the joker for me. That would be uh, That would be great. Are you cool with that? Yeah, man. Because if you're happy, I'm happy. But it's, uh, it's important that you're happy. Yeah? I'm happy. Good stuff. So, um, we have uh, your Joker, which we'll get back to in a bit. We have the stick man on the card box. And then we have, most importantly, the four aces. Now, there's a rule in magic. Don't tell the audience what's going to happen. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to do something amazing with that stick man and these aces. So we have the ace of diamonds, we have the ace of hearts, uh, we have the ace of spades, and then finally we have the ace of clubs. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try and clone that stick man one by one. And I'm going to start off with the ace of clubs. Watch. All I have to do is touch the, uh, the ace of clubs to the little stick man, and then I just take this card, rub for a second, and I get a little stick man right there. <laughs> Uh, right on the back of the Ace of Clubs. Now let's try that again, because maybe you missed it. This time we're going to use the Ace of Diamonds right there. Look, there's the Ace of Diamonds. You just touch the Ace of Diamonds to the little stick dude. You wait a split second, and when you do... <laughs> another stick man, right? <laughs> so that's two stick men right there. Let's do it again. We've got we're two cards left. Multiplying stick men. So multiplying stick men. So uh, this time the ace of spades. Watch, not the ace of uh, hearts, the ace of spades. I'll just rub for a split second. There he is. That's another one. It's kind of really what weird at this point. Isn't it? Yeah, I don't even understand it. Like, this stuff just happens to me. It's why I became a magician. Uh, the hardest one is the ace of hearts. And the reason is this is the only one that I can't cover with the other cards. So I just have to rub it like that. And that one goes. Are we following this? No. No, not making any sense at all, I didn't think so. <laughs> to be clear, we now have a situation where we have one, two, three, four stick men. Now, the reason I want to clone these stick men and the reason I need four stick men is for this reason. Watch. If I just take the stick men on the aces and do this, do you know what happens? No. Well, the stick men vanish again. Now, there's no stick men oh, there. Oh, where have they gone? There's no stick man there. There's no stick man there. There's no stick man there. You know why? Why? Because I riffle towards your hand, and your joker's been under there the whole time. Lift up your hand. Turn over the joker. <gasps> All four stick men. <laughs> <laughs> but check this out. You can, you can, I mean, you can keep that as a souvenir, that but before mess, you do... the messed up boy band? Watch there. this. If I just take my hand and touch that stick man, and then I rub it right here on the deck... <laughs> We get another stick man right there. This one's uh, on the Queen of Spades. Let's try it again. Watch, you take the Queen of Spades, yeah? And if I just touch it to that stick man, and then I touch it to the deck, and I wait a second, yeah, you get a stick man there as well. <laughs> In fact, if I touch the entire deck, look at what happens. Stick man, stick man, <gasps> stick man, 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 stick man. Every no, I... single card has now got a stick man on the back of it. And you, my friend, can examine everything. We've got an army of stick men. I know, right? How weird's that? <laughs> they were genuinely <laughs> are. There's an army of stick men. No way. There you go. See, cloning is a real thing. <laughs> Apparently so. <laughs> what the fuck? So there you go, guys. That's another magic live in the bag. Do me a favour. Let me know what you think in the video down below. In the comments down below. You want to see more videos like this? Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. I'll be back again tomorrow at 6 o'clock with the Magic Live. I'll see you then.